Put down. Swipe down. Maybe you're. What? I'm learning. Hello, everybody. Oh, we've got hearts. Hi. Hey, girl. Hey. <laughs> Hi everybody, uh, welcome um, Periscope Live. We're gonna make a habit of doing this every no. fun day or days that my life, my wife will be happy about it. Okay. <clears throat> thank goodness I made it. Yes, I'm glad that you made it. Okay, look, oh, wow, oh, thank you. So once I look good. Okay, guys, so, um, as, <laughs> can I show them you? Mm -hmm. This my beautiful wife eating, we just made spring rolls, so I'm going to enjoy them after this live chat. Um, the wall, okay, I can show you guys the wall. Uh, whoa, it's pretty big right now. We're, I've added a bunch. You can kind of see. That's gonna say love. Okay, so, um, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Would I consider going on the Amazing Race Canada? Um, I, yes, I would, not right now, because I'm still in the middle of my rehab, but um, yes, I would eventually. Can you teach me to paint like that? Um, eventually. How can I order a McLeod Canada jersey? You should be able to order a Canada jersey online, like canadasoccer.com. And uh, yeah, if there's any trouble with that, um, yeah, I don't know who you contact. There's a contact actually info on there. Okay, whoa, 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 okay. What do you do after a bad game? Uh, that's a good question. Um, I am an emotional person. <laughs> Okay, thanks for that, Ella. Um, so after games, if I make a bad mistake, generally what I try to do is uh, either meditate that night or go over the clips as fast as I can so I can look at the actual mistake, take emotion out of it, and then learn from it and move on. Okay, um, next question. Thank you for inspiring me to take up drawing after I stop for some of it. Oh, nice. UK fan. Um, yeah, I think the nice thing about drawing too, for everyone who's a meditator, it's really good for your heart and for your head. What do you eat in a day? Depend. You should show them which one they think is mine and yours. <laughs> um, this is what we made tonight. <laughs> Ella's is this one. <laughs> and these are mine. Okay. Um, I try to eat kind of healthy. Um... Mm -hmm. Really healthy. Okay. Try is a um, I don't eat a lot of sugar. I don't eat a lot of gluten. But um, I try to. I think I'd like to be better at the gluten-free stuff, like eating potatoes and sweet potatoes instead of like gluten-free bread, because it's still like processed. I try to stay away from processed foods. Explain to them the story the other night. Why well, should I was proud of you? I had a burger and fries the other night, and it's the first time I've taken that. Uh, I've brought that meal home for the entire time I've known my wife, three years. So. And I told her I was proud. Does Ella ever wear a shirt? That's a good question. Do you want me to wear a shirt? Okay. <laughs> um, you have avocado mm -hmm. all over your face. How do you prevent... Okay, wow. Who would you say is the most inspirational Man City, Man United player? United. Okay, well, Man City player? Um, Not your boy, no. Joe Hart's kind of been getting the can lately. Um, I think Aguero's pretty good. Um, he shows up pretty big uh, in games. And Man U, I'm not the biggest Manchester United fan, but I, De Gea, I think, is an unbelievable goalkeeper. Um, so has Ella been knighted? No. Uh, moving on, what would you come back after your third ACL rather than retire? No one is complaining. Someone said about your shirt problem. I know. All right, everybody, calm down. Um, I want to know who you were. Okay, how do you know that? Um, wow, there's so many. You girls are funny. What do you do on your downtime? This is uh, our downtime, actually. Sunday, fun day. Today we went uh, at a nice coffee by the water. We went to a skate park to watch. <laughs> uh, went for brunch. Uh, well, I think it's important one day a week to just chill. 
and do as little as you can. I'm actually trying that out. I've never done it before, but I'm trying it out now. Week one. <laughs> What's my favorite thing about Ella? Mm, aside from her appetite, um, my favorite thing about Ella is she's the most determined person that I know. And she works really hard. And she has a really big heart. That was more than one. Tell me what your least favorite thing about me. My least favorite thing about Ella is she leaves every single cupboard and Not drawer them. open. Sometimes freezer doors, which can be a problem. Um, hi, everybody. Hi. Who asked who about first? This is a funny story because everyone thinks I'm the emotional mush. Ella said that she had fall she fell in love with me long before we even started dating. So, um, okay. Our first date. Okay. Our wow. This is more of a love. Um, okay. Maxwell is nine. Someone said, why would you leave cabinets open? That's so bad, Ella. <laughs> it's a habit. It's a habit. It's, you know, that's the thing about unconditional love. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, keep the questions coming. I'm sorry. What inspires you on a day-to-day -day basis? Um, yes, Ella's inspiring, but um, also... Um, Making a difference. Yeah, making a difference. I like, uh, I really like helping people, but I also really like learning and getting better myself. And um, the other day, Ella kicked a bunch of balls. I was like just sitting on a chair and she was kicking a bunch of balls um, into my hands and it was, um, I love the game so much. So I feel like... And then you um, couldn't tell what you, that happened the next night, you couldn't fall asleep. And then I couldn't fall asleep because all I could imagine was top corner saves. So I might be getting older. Someone said, how, how did I decide to come back? I think I just love it. I mean, I'll always love it, but uh, I still think I have a lot of improvements to make, and I, I still want to, um, yeah, wanna kill it out on the field. You want to have it your choice. Yeah, and I want to choose. Yeah, thank you. Hey, Aaron, I'm a uh, goalkeeper. love how you play. Thank you very much. Before games, yes, I do listen to music. I listen to uh, a variety of music. I try not to be, like, too amped up because I'm a very amped up person I know it's hard to believe um so I just like to chill I have chill music before games can I speak French oui je parle français beaucoup de français parce que j'ai appris uh, l'immersion parce que je suis canadien okay I have your okay how good is your Swedish now mine is um not so great but Ellis is very very good and she put a shirt on just for you guys you are a role model thank you very much um, oh, look at all these hearts. It's so beautiful. Do you believe in appreciating the journey more than the destination? Um, I'm guilty of, I'm guilty of this. This is mine. You can do your own periscope. Um, yeah, I, I focus a lot, of, a lot of the times when I'm really upset with a lot of mistakes I make and it's hard to answer seriously with a face <laughs> like that. But, um, when I come back to the journey and like the love of the game and the love of what I'm doing, then I'm a much happier person and I feel like I learn a lot more. What are the next targets? Uh, my tar more, uh, okay, my targets now returning back. I want to be. I want to continue to be a more calm goalkeeper. Um, I want to be a good leader, and um, I'm gonna. Um, Ella will no longer be part of these chats. Okay, it's just you guys and me. Um, but I also want to do like top corner saves. I want to uh, be sick with both feet. Um, there's a lot of, I, I, I'll list it and don't worry if you keep track of the motivation.ca, I'm actually going to go through a bunch of my own goal settings and share it with you guys. And hopefully you can go through some of your goal setting. And then when we kind of meet up every, whether it's every weekend or whatever I'm allowed, um, then we can kind of discuss it together. <laughs> Will you back, be back on the Canadian national team? Yes, I hope so. That's the plan. What made you start Motive Nation? Um, the reason I started Motive Nation actually was because uh, when I got hurt, a lot of people started reaching out to me and telling me stories about uh, a lot of the hard times they'd been through and how they overcame it. And I thought it was... Um, look at this one. Um, and I thought it was so inspiring and I was hoping to have that same effect on other people. So and I'm getting um, more and more people writing... <laughs> these stories and that's why I'm uh, interviewing all these different people from different walks of life so I can see what moves them every day so that hopefully we can all find someone that we can relate to. My video stops all the time. I'm sorry about that. Do you have any um, Aaron and Ella shows? We might do a few of these together. 
we'll see. Who has bigger muscles? That's nice. Ella has more defined muscles. I'll give her that. Hi from Belgium. That's because I run. <laughs> That's funny. Did anyone get that? That's because she runs is what she just said. Okay. <laughs> Uh, when is my, when is my album coming out? Well, um, we haven't quite decided, but Ella and I are actually singing at a wedding no, this fall. Ella and I are not. Well, sing. I'm singing and Ella is on, uh, Lindsay the guitar. Lindsay wedding. Hi from Idaho and Yellowknife. Hi. Do you have, uh, what do you do? I didn't see that. Can you do the Rian move? <laughs> um, I'm not sure. Where's Maxwell? Begging. Begging for food. Uh, hi from Alberta. Hi. Uh, what do you do after goal? Any routines? I know you didn't see it. <laughs> oh, thank you for writing it again. Uh, after goals, normally I like shout and I jump and I cheer really loud. And then after that one second, I realize I'm a goalkeeper and I'm totally alone. So I go to the goal and I normally get some water. Hi from Costa Rica. Can you guys please come back to Chicago? I love Chicago. One of my favorite cities. We'll be back in November. Okay, we got a three more minutes to go. Keep it coming. Keep the questions coming. Rian Wilkins' dance, dance moves. Is that you, Rian? <laughs> Okay, wait. Hi from Compton. What is your wow? Oh, how do you deal with anxiety? Was one question for me. Yeah. Um. Now, to you know what it is, I just change the subject, quote unquote. So if I start feeling like I'm getting something or symptoms. It's actually been really good now that I know what it is. Um, I'll change what I'm doing. So I'll either go for a walk or play the guitar or um. Have it here entertain me. <laughs> All the above. Okay, fine. Oh, favorite movie? What's your favorite movie? Prime, Transformers, favorite thing. It yeah. is. She actually loves um, the soundtrack a lot. She runs to it. St. Louis with my FCR scarf. Oh, nice. St. Louis scarf. First game playing f for my club today. Awesome. Congrats. What do you guys do? I so fast. What is your favorite part of being a goalkeeper? Making a save. Like, this is an after run. Okay. Honestly? <laughs> Oops, I'm going to kick you out of the house. Uh, top corner saves. and Just anything with air time. <coughs> Thank you. Um, unfortunately, next time we have one of these socks, Ella might not be included. Who is Maxwell's favorite? This is Ella. Uh, it's Ty. Um, you guys are awesome. Thank you. Do you remember me? I drove eight hours to see you in Malma. Um, I'd have to see if photo but I uh, yes oh Ella does biggest piece of advice for a young goalkeeper okay this is important don't, dwell on your mistakes. don't thank you don't dwell on your mistakes um, Ella is actually just gonna run the show next time met Ella in Dallas in 2004 and she was the sweetest wow well, I don't know about that okay anything else who is the worst singer on the Canadian national team it used to be Karina um, but I don't know anymore uh, Maxwell, living the dream. Who are these ladies? Hi, nice to meet you. Favorite part of being an aunt? Um, an aunt? Um, I don't know. I just think their faces, they're so cute. And, um, it's cool to feel so, like, connected to, um, to someone. Um, are you still involved with Potaloo? Yes, I am. Ella, thanks for remembering me. I appreciate it. Gotcha. How old are you when you started soccer? Seriously? I was like, oh, seriously? Uh, I was probably like 12 or 13. I started when I was five. When did you start? Five. Would you ever get a second dog? We were looking today. Okay. Can I send... Um, hi. Hi. Yes, Hello. Can. can I send a dash jersey get signed? Yes, you can. Do you want to give them the address? The stadium address? 13 Pidmud's Pil Garden. I don't know how to do it. <laughs> Search Malmo Ipe, I P. Yeah. yeah. And it will give it to you. It's like pills by God in. Ooh, mess that up. Ooh. Do I have your permission to. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Not repeating that one. Keep PG. Please. Thank you very much. Um, trying to inspire my niece to take up playing football. Oh my gosh, last minute. Okay. Um, ignoring it, pregame ritual. Uh, pre-game ritual, um, for me, I, I like to like write my journal at some point before the game and just talk about the things I want to focus on and then, um, I just try to like really relax as much as I can. How about you? Before a game. 
uh, yeah, we have a walk and stretch that we do, and then tr if I'm playing forward, then you try to, I try to visualize uh, what could happen in the game, the situation I could be in, that kind of stuff. Cool. Okay, guys, uh, we're gonna, uh, how do you do it? Shut her down. What's the thing about? Do, do I honestly like working out? I Actually, I love working out. Yes, I do. Not every day. Sometimes I don't want to work out, but you got to push through it, you know? Uh, I see my name, but then it goes to you. It's so fast. What's, What's the best thing about playing with Carly Lloyd? Her humor. <laughs> <laughs> she can be a real uh, competitor, so it's always fun to compete in. They make her squirm a bit. Yeah, they make fun of each other very good. How does Ella motivate one as far as your art? Okay, we're getting a lot of the similar yeah. questions. Two more, do you got two more minutes because you were late. Oh, really? Is that how it works? Okay. Um, Ella, how's the sleeve coming along? Not done, but it won't get longer, but I'm going to go on inside soon, so that should be fun. Yep. Um, cockroaches? <laughs> That's fine. Not in Sweden that I've seen. Um, best quality of errands? Oh, go ahead. Um... Your best quality? Yeah. There's too many to count. Okay. But try to try uh, to give us best more. quality. She is always the bigger person. Oh. She teaches me to be a lot softer, not so fighty. Maybe that's the right word. Fighty. I'm very protective. Um, how do you focus when play is on the opposite end of the field? That's a good question as a goalkeeper. Um, the best way for me is I just communicate as much as I can to my defenders and like prepare for transitional play. Will you be having any kids soon? Stay tuned. <laughs> we have two years of our contract, so we will see after that. Yeah. Hopefully we'll win the Champions League and then... Can't decide. Will you do commission pieces? Yes, I do some uh, commission art pieces. Uh, if you are interested, go to or email Dodson, D O D S O N, Betty, B E T T Y 1 at gmail.com. Thank you. How do you deal with fans chanting negative things at you? Um, again, this is where like a lot of my meditation uh, training comes in, but. Ella's rolling her eyes at me. Um, she doesn't meditate. You wouldn't be chanting if you weren't good enough to chant. Um, I just try to, again, kind of like along the lines of the communication. I try my best to just stay involved with the play and uh, talk to my defenders and give as much information as I can and always be an option uh, for a pass back. So I'm actually running a lot, despite what some people say <laughs> in games. Uh, how do you... Uh, Okay, so uh, I wanted to say thank you, everyone. Oh, someone got a print. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you very much. Um, so uh, I will keep you guys uh, in the loop. Um, we'll try and do this again sometime soon, maybe next weekend. Um, yeah, so keep your questions for next time, and we'll check back in. Thank you. Bye, guys.